Hi, my name is Sean. I'm a pin setter mechanic. I'm certified to work on Brunswick A, A2, and Jetback pin setters. Now, today's uh, video, we're going to be doing the cycle solenoid adjustment. Now, this will only uh, apply to A2s or people that have converted to the 24 volt solenoids. If you have the 32 volt solenoids, please get rid of them. <laughs> they're they're slower. They're not as good, and I just can't really see what's going on and the adjustments are kind of weird for it. So anyways, uh, like any other adjustment, we're going to turn off our breaker, unplug it. Now, I do mine uh, different than the book. It's uh, my, my way I found is just simpler. So what we're going to do is we're going to loosen up the two screws that hold the solenoid on. And what you're going to do is you're going to cycle it and move it all the way up while keeping pressure on the solenoid so that way they make their complete contact and then you're going to go ahead and tighten up the screws that hold the solenoid the other thing you want to double check for is make sure everything is straight make sure plunger when it goes in is straight it's not cockeyed or so that way it doesn't get bound up or anything like that um so uh, we're going to plug in our machine, turn the breaker on, let it go through its cycle. And then when we get back, it should cycle no problem off the button over here. Okay, so when I push this button, it's going to cycle, just because that's how confident I am. No issues, first try, and that's it. So, I know the book has like, I don't know, three, four, five, six steps to this adjustment, but I mean, I've, I've found this so much easier just to, at zero degrees, to just pull up on the solenoid all the way up, and squeeze the solenoid to make sure they stay together and then tighten up the screws in the back. I mean, it's three things you gotta do. And I'm, please leave in the comments below on like if this actually works because I'm wanting to know if this works across centers or if this is just just me getting lucky all the time, which I find, find really hard to believe, but I could be wrong. You know, I have 24 lanes that way and another few that way that I've converted with these things and that adjustment has worked every single time so uh i would really really like to know if this adjustment has worked for other people so please leave that in the comments below any questions you have please leave those in the comments below too i'm more than happy to answer those and i will see you guys in the next video bye